welcome to Gaming and Gabbing. It's with me, Big Big Bird, Gentle Cream. Boy, boy number one. and Boy number one. Little Bird number, Big Boy number two. <laughs> little Bird, Big Boy. So you're, yeah. you're, you're, you're I, I was about, I was about to say Little Bird number boy. two. I called you boy number one, so like, gosh. Uh, like, so, oh, I, if you're a little bird but a big boy, what a uh, what 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 kind of bird would you be? Where you are approximately that size? Probably an ostrich. That's the only thing I can think of that would be like bigger than like a little boy. <laughs> yeah, little no. Ostrich. When when I think of an ostrich, the first thing that comes to my mind is, oh, that's a little bird. <laughs> well, a little, so like a little ostrich. <laughs> Bigger than a big boy. Yeah, yeah, no, that's just that's just little bird. All right, all right, let's uh, let's jump into one of these streams. I mean, so so we decided today we're gonna we're gonna check out some some Returnal. Let's um here let's, I should refresh the page. It's been a little while since I've been on this page. All right, let's refresh the page. Make sure these are all live. Mm, looks strikingly the same. It looks strikingly the same. Let's check out uh let's check out the number one. Well, he's number one, but he's not the one with the most views, right? Because here's the guy with the most views, and then second most. But yeah, yeah. So he's got he's got to have the stuff then. Yeah, he's got the he's got that good good. All right, Squilla Killa. All right, we're gonna mute Squilla Killa. We're gonna work through the ads. Okay. So, is a little bird ostrich. Um, Wait. What? What's this ad? I don't know. It's an ad for a thing. For, for, for pills it's an ad for pills say so pill yourself up boy all right so so okay first of all squilla killa we're gonna follow this man give him that give him that good good follow and you guys should follow him too but uh looks do you like, know anything about this game uh i mean you run and shoot things what is there to know about this game right look at that like See, he, he's running and he's shooting things right and then I seen one of those in my neighborhood today. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. just yeah. last last Thursday, I had to go out and actually deal yeah. with with this exact yeah. situation. Yeah, I think they call them dogs where I'm at. <laughs> oh, that's a dog. That's a bold. <laughs> that's a bold choice. We're gonna say that, that as a dog, right? <laughs> oh, what do they call in your neighborhood? Uh, giant tentacle beast. Actually, is probably how I describe it in my neighborhood. Yeah, look at this look at this man squilla killa also so in the center of your screen you notice when he reloads uh do you have you ever played a game that has an active reload mechanic mm -mm. so as part of the reloading animation there's like a little mini game and if you hit the button correctly you reload faster right so you'll uh, you'll see you'll see him do this a couple times it's in the very center of the screen there'll be a little left righty thingy that i saw but I don't know. Oh, he just got nailed by that. Did you see him just get hit? Oh, Squilla Killa. Come Wait, on, so my man. So if you fail the reload mechanic, do you like just not reload? Or no, no, it's just slower. It's just slower. It's just slower. It's, it's, yeah, yeah, yeah. They like, they, they soft. They soft hurt you, right? It's not like. <laughs> you got like a laser sword. Yeah. The, uh, do you not use a laser sword for hunting dogs in your neighborhood? Oh, he just got no, a game. Oh, you come on. This guy's. Like, cut apples and stuff. Cut apples? Yeah. How do you. Like a kitchen utensil. How do you cut apples? What are you cutting off an apple? Are you cutting an apple into slices? Or are you using it to try yeah. and get the skin off an apple? Are you, are you maneuvering this laser sword to slowly peel the skin off an apple, working your way around it? Is it a curved laser sword or is it a flat laser sword? Well, I have the same one that he has. So it's oh, you, get, you got the 10 foot long flat one. Wait, wait, why are you so against this apple thing? I don't know. I was, I was curious about what you're doing to the apple because, you know, I mean, I mean... We're recording here, and I don't want to, you know, like throw you out or anywhere. But uh... I feel like I was attacked. <laughs> <laughs> My choice of cutting an apple is heavily scrutinized. But if you're if you're cutting an apple with a ten foot knife, even even if it wasn't a laser sword, let's let's forget about the fact that you said you're cutting with a laser sword. If it was a ten foot knife, I'd probably criticize you for cutting an apple with a ten foot knife. You know, especially if it's on the daily, it's not a special occasion. You know, maybe it's maybe it's a, maybe it's uh, your birthday, and you're like, I want to just cut an apple. <laughs> Right in half with a big ass sword, you know. That's cool. That's on you. But doing I mean, it because I, it's a Thursday. Did you ever play uh, Fruit Ninja? Oh. Yeah. 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 Oh. Like, your, your history's come out. All this shit you've been talking. Ooh. So I have not ever played Fruit Ninja, but I am aware that it is a popular game. That a. So um, how's he gonna do this? What are you talking about? You've seen, like you've, one at a time, right? you've, you've seen Resident Evil, right? What you just you just sprint it? 
yeah, yeah, yeah. He just sprints it and then he gets cubed. And then he gets cut in little bitty bitty cubes. And it's like, it's not a big oh, deal. Oh, God, yeah. Where? Oh, he decided he didn't want none. Oh, he decided he didn't want none. Yeah, he's, he's actually <laughs> oh, my God, he's terrified. <laughs> you, can, you can feel him shaking in his boots. <laughs> I'm gonna try to go around like no dude like how do you not try that it's like it's like someone that uh that goes up to the edge of a swimming pool right and they like dip their toe in and like no 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 I actually I forgot I'm actually allergic to water and they just like immediately run you cannot hang out with those types of people you can't trust them they can't trust them but they just I mean imagine just generating a spontaneous water allergy out of nothing dude a spontaneous water allergy out of nothing. You you can't trust. You never know what's going to happen next. Maybe they're going to be allergic to I don't know, like a uh, human sweat and just break out in hives or something. I don't I don't know. Yeah, you can never never trust those. Never trust them. You never know is what's going to happen. Is he going to go back? No, 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 no. Once once a, once someone has decided that they have hydrophobia, they never go back. It's over, dude. It's over. To be fair, to be fair though. To like, be fair. Okay, what, do you know what the phobia is for, like, being afraid of deep water? So, okay, so hydrophobia, right, which uh, would, the thing that makes sense, right, is not actually, so act reload, see it? Oh, he got the one! He got the one! Oh, did you see it, the little mini game in the middle of the screen? I was too, I was too busy looking at, uh... oh, there, wait. So, hi, so hydrophobia is actually the name for rabies, right? Even though it's a thing that makes yes, even though it's a thing that might like makes sense for it to be like, oh, you're afraid of water, but it's like, no, you're not yeah. afraid of water. You have rabies, and it's like, uh, uh that's because when you get rabies, uh, something happens with like your mouth, like where you can't actually drink water. Yeah, you start foaming. Well, so so there's that, but you also like can't drink water, but you want water. So for some reason, like people interpreted that as you being afraid of water. I don't, I don't know. I don't something like that. I don't know. If, I might be making it up. Who Do fucking you try knows? Try to drink it. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. So like, yeah. So you like want water but can't have it. I don't. I think. I don't know. I'm not. I'm not like an expert. Never had before. Yeah. I'm not, <laughs> I'm not like. <laughs> can't speak from personal experience on this one. Yeah. And I only think that I'm like a little bit bullshitting. I could be completely wrong. <laughs> Who knows? Jesus. Oh, there we go. Okay, but we, do we have the confidence now? He's going to dip out. I bet you he dips out. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. He's got his speedo okay. on already. He dollars because he dies. He dies. No, no, no. He's got his speedo on. He's ready. He's got... Oh, look at that. He oh. just he just rolled in. He just rolled in. Look at that. No... Oh. Wait. What a champion. Just do that in the other part. Uh, so it's quite a bit further, right? I don't think he could spam roll all the way. But maybe. Maybe, yeah. Oh. Oh, he wants some more. He wanted to come back and talk shit? <laughs> <laughs> it wasn't enough for him, dude. Yo, something cool? To, you scared me back. off before you didn't realize I'm back? And I'll give a shit about you, swimming pool. <laughs> <laughs> he had to do it for his, the sake of his pride. He had to regain it. Yeah. Yeah. It's, it's someone saw him. His, his girl that he's had his eye on saw him, right? And was like, ooh. I see that you could not handle your water, good sir. And he's like, "What do you mean? No, 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 no! I had to, I had to go get a, I, I had eaten in the last thirty minutes, you know, and I didn't want to get cramps, and I, yeah, I had forgotten. Yeah, I'm being responsible. Yeah. I'm not being afraid. Now that that digestion's done, let me show you uh, how, how much I can slap this water around. <laughs> so okay, okay, going back to deep water. Do you know the fear of deep water? Mm -mm. No, like just... the name. The name. You talking about the name of it, right? Yeah. Oh no, no. That's what, I, that's what I'm commenting on. I thought you knew. That's why you brought it up. No, I was asking. I was asking, like, no, like the name, because I'm like, I feel like hydrophobia. Like, you can sign us up. No. Uh, so I mean, like, literally, phobia is scared in large places. I know that. So now we just got to find it... the two. Agora. So which which one's first? Hydro hydrogoria goria hydro hydrogoria sounds decent. Agor hydrogoria sure sure agor Agor agordro 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 agordrophobic yeah dude yeah. I mean if we can't make up fake old languages like Latin then what can we make up? Look at that square! Oh that was sick! Did you see that square that's shooting? That thing just came out of nowhere. This guy actually has insane like. 
peripherals. Dude, he's got that uh, that wide field of view. You know, he's got that the FOV rangefinder all the way up. Has that ultra wide monitor too? That ultra wide monitor. It's honestly just cheating, right? It's just rich people getting uh, richer, right? Dude, that shit looks like kind of. <laughs> oh painful. shit! Like how you said attaches to him. You said like wizard thing. It was like shooting like circles from the side. Oh yeah, Jesus! You know oh, oh they're, wow! They're chasing him. Oh wow! <laughs> He, he might be in trouble. Did he get hit? He dodged that. He no, dodged he, that. He, no, no, he got hit. He got hit. Oh, and then he fell into the water. So he died. His health's in the bottom oh, left. No, he takes some damage. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That thing's got. Oh, that thing's got an apple cutter. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, that's what you use. <laughs> you see that, Henry? Okay, you have you have to have like invuln frames. I feel like dodge that. Yeah. That thing is no joke. Oh, there's another apple cutter. Okay. Wow, what is this guy? <laughs> Oh, this, what's, what's the man that works at the that like works at the orchard? They don't just call him a farmer, do they? Uh, I feel like he has have a special name. Uh, yeah, it's Apple Man. It's it's oh, it's Johnny. They call him Johnny. Oh yeah, Johnny Appleseed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah that's Johnny Appleseed right there. <laughs> All Johnny Appleseed protecting his, protecting his assets. Ooh, I mean, looking too hot. If you what thought the shit he's collecting. Uh, it's it's bling, you know. He's got to he's got to cover himself in gold dust so that he could f intimidate his enemies. Or have you seen um uh uh assassin beetles? Do you know what assassin beetles are? Assassin beetles? Uh huh. I've seen Asian beetles? <laughs> yeah, I've seen ladybug also. <laughs> I've seen ladybug. That's pretty. That's pretty exotic. <laughs> So, I'm, I'm assuming they're, they're relatively similar. Yeah, 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 basically the same thing. Basically the same thing. So assassin beetles, right? They like go around and murder things because you know because they don't give a shit. But the big thing that assassin beetles do is they like put pieces of enemies that they murder on their back, right? They like incorporate that into their shell. So they just have like, Jesus Christ. yeah, it's that's so hardcore. It's so metal. It's so metal. But that's exactly what uh what our boy uh. Squilla Kill is doing here, right? Is he's 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 turning his enemies into fine powder, and he's just rubbing that powder into his face like it's a uh, like it's a lotion, right? He just he just bathes in the powder of his enemies. It's, it must be working. He has a decent complexion every time we get to see his face. Oh yeah, it's it's real good actually. Yeah, I'm I'm, I'm honestly surprised at how well it works. Uh, anti aging cream. I've never seen an anti aging cream that works. Even comparable to the blood and powder of your enemies, Jesus. Oh what? Oh, he, he doesn't want any of it. Just this roll. Doesn't seem that bad. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's two. There's two squares. There's three. Oh, it's three. It's three. Oh, three yeah. wide. You got tons of room. Yeah. What is the destruction of property, dude? No kidding. No respect. These kids nowadays. No respect. This isn't some link shit where every time you see something, you got break it. Yeah. Yeah. I'm, yeah. Oh. Okay, so oh, kind you of, have enough time to run. Yeah, yeah, and, yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. He had tons of time actually. I want. I need one of these to really amp it up. This game's looking a little too casual for me. We need to. We need to turn this knob from seven to like, mm, like four hundred. You know. That's that's how, like a seven, seven out of like a thousand scale right now. No, 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 like a seven out of ten scale. It's 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 currently on seven out of ten, right? And I need it to be at like. Four, I mean, the one that looked actually hard, he just dipped out. Oh, look at that. Just roll through it. There you go. See, look easy. That was an invuln frame. Yeah, right? yeah, yeah, yeah. His little, his little dash is his invuln frame. Where he just kind of like, he just kind of elbows things. <laughs> Whenever you're in doubt, Sam, about like whether something. So, so okay. So, so when you're in combat, right? Because you know we're all we're all professional soldiers that murder people for a living. You know, when you're in combat and you see an enemy across from you. Remember, always lead with your shoulder, because as long as you're leading with your shoulder, he can't hurt you. You are invincible. And that's the thing that I've learned from this game, right? You see? Probably. You see how he just led with his shoulder into that jump? He cannot be hurt while what leading with his shoulder. they lead with their shoulder, right? That's like kind of like the unstoppable object, unmovable object type thing. Unstoppable force. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. and, and big ass rock. Uh-huh. Yeah. Uh-huh. Um... Yeah, that's a that's a real problem. I would assume. Be, I would assume black holes are created. 
I would assume actually is what it does is you just pass through each other and you just keep going until you hit someone who doesn't have their shoulder edged. But then by the time you turn around, you're like, Ugh! and you're like, Ugh! and you both, you both realize like what happened that you literally just phase through each other. You like cease to exist as you phase through each other. Then you're just like, uh, you've ascended. You've ascended to God. This, this is actually an X-Men ability with the juggernaut. Oh, where it leads with the shoulder? Yeah. Yeah, he just leads with his shoulder. He just comes unstoppable. Well, no, no, he just actually doesn't have any powers, right? That's just he just figured it out. Yeah, he he, he just had a big enough brain for it. Yeah, yeah, he's like he's the. You thought Xavier was a smart one? Get oh my god, we're getting uh, tag teamed here. We're gonna we're gonna jump from all sides. <laughs> okay, this looks this looks potentially dangerous. Ooh. Oh my god! What? Ooh. Slice that man like amoeba slices an apple. <laughs> Yo, this guy, this guy's popping off though. Like, I love it. I love it. I love like, it. I can see why Johnny Appleseed was upset with him <laughs> as he was <laughs> traveling across America, planting his apple seeds. Like ah, uh, and he did it entirely yeah. out of spite to Squillakilla. <clears throat> he knew that Squillakilla is going to be like throwing as much. Destro like bows as he can at apples just gonna be cutting apples all day every day and he's like you know what i gotta make sure that there's a plethora of apple trees ready for this man for you know 2021 when squilla killer hits his stride and just starts murdering apples like it's nothing straight slicing what do you think, his, uh, what do you think his ammo system is do you think there is ammo nah nah nah, nah. It's, i'm pretty sure it's unlimited it, well it's like it's like a clip that's unlimited right uh-huh so like you got oh Oh, oh god. He got blasted good from the right. side. Oh yeah, he's actually really low. Yo, he didn't he didn't respect this the man shooting squares from behind him. <clears throat> Our anti-hero might be done here. He's uh he's too used to that like uh the like uh the like hippie idea, right? Of like um oh he failed back to reload too. Of you know, like squares are bad, like you should you don't want to be a square, right? So he just was completely ignoring the fact that the square was behind him, just blasted him and he's like, You don't <laughs> you don't exist in my world. You you <laughs> <laughs> just trying his best to ignore it yeah and uh, the problem again is if someone gets behind you how are you gonna lead with your shoulder when someone's behind you <clears throat> you know the one that weakness actually, might actually be impossible yeah 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 that's, that's why a trucker not always keeps going in front of him mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. i feel like with him failing to active reload for the first time once he got low i think i think this man cannot handle pressure yeah 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 yeah, yeah. where's he going too <clears throat> he's running he's terrified yeah 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 you gotta play smarter not play scared as a i don't even know what's what's a scared thing as a newborn kitten <clears throat> as a baby on nestle <laughs> yeah old old nestle itself i need a yeah. i need a little bit of aqua wrestling with the nestle wrestle with the nestle there you go Ooh. wrestling <clears throat> Speaking of yeah, speaking See? of Nestle, let me get some. Let me get some of this water. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cherish, cherish that water, baby. While while we still have it, and it hasn't been turned into uh, Nestle water. <laughs> they're they're on their way. They're on their way to. I mean, they they, they 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 saw you uh, drinking water on stream, and they're like, whoa, 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 whoa. How much did you pay for that? And you're like, nothing. They're like, hold up, <clears throat> hold up. That's not fair. We think that'll be like the new DMCA, like so like the copyright for music and stuff. Mm -hmm. It'll just be like Nestle just coming around, like anytime they see someone just drinking un like non Nestle water. Non 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 copywritten water. Yeah. Oh, yeah. There we go. Yeah, you got you gotta prove that you bought it from a yeah. a designated water disp dispenser distributor. Mm -hmm. A thing. A water yeah, thing. Black market water. <laughs> I can't get that shit from a well. <laughs> Nestle approved well. Ooh. So, what does Nestle do about clouds then in this situation? I'm sh I thought they already had uh, the paperwork in. Yeah. To to own the clouds. They just have like <clears throat> they have a series of jets that have a giant net spread out between them, right? And they just follow rain clouds around, just catching it all. <laughs> <laughs> There's no way that could I mean, ever possibly go wrong, right? I mean, just do like, so like the flat Earth people. I like, think we like live in a dome, uh -huh, right? Uh huh. 
like they could just like have something similar where like I mean it's not a dome, right? But like something similar that like we live under that it's just Nestle's water collector. Okay, okay, okay. Alternate idea for you. Alternate idea for you. Um we have a situation where I uh shit. <laughs> I lost my train of thought. Do you think next we will start owning ice caps? When I was like the ice caps, so like when the ice caps melt, right? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. They then become in the ocean. And once they're in the ocean, right? They're part of the water cycle. When they're part of the white water cycle, Nestle can like have claim over any water. Ooh, yes, yes. We just take. I like that. I like that. We just take all the glaciers. Take. Oh, I mean, all the water. Honestly, all that salt water. That's not, mm-hmm. no one, we can't be just allowing people to go swimming in the ocean. We can't allow fish to just be drinking our water. They're contaminating our water. You know the gross things that fish do in water? Ugh. Yeah. We can't just allow that to happen. That's yeah, good, no, that's good quality yeah. water that we can overcharge people mm-hmm. for. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I mean, like, shoot, dude, like. That is a potential. Well, overcharge, overcharge is kind of an aggressive <laughs> word, right? Yeah. I mean, there, like, there's potential that, that could be Kool Aid. I'm just saying. Mm-hmm, I don't know. Mm-hmm. I don't know if yeah, a shark ever considered the fact that he's swimming in something that could potentially become Kool Aid. Oh. Also, like going back real quick, can mm-hmm. you really ever overcharge something? I mean, water is like. Oh, know, the key it's to life, yeah. Right? It's it's a straight supply demand curve. So you could you could it's it's a yeah. inelastic good, right? They they have to have it. So like you just yeah. charge whatever you want, and they're gonna pay. Like, exactly. I mean, that's the, that's the thing, right? It's like. And can you put a light? Can you put a price on life? Right? Mm-hmm. No. Well, I mean, right? Nestle can, but you know, you can. Cool. That's what. I'm, but I mean, that the point is, right? Nestle is trying to put a fair price, mm-hmm. right? They they know they're underselling the water, right? Because if water equals life, you can't put a price on life, right? Mm-hmm. So, whatever chart price Nestle wants to charge would still be not enough. Oh. You can always charge a higher price. Oh, I like this so idea. Really they're doing us a solid. I like this idea. I like this idea that Nestle is Nestle is the bro. Nestle bro. The Archimedes principle back when like whatever number like whenever like you have like the when you learn about like the integers or like uh uh like like when you learn like there's an infinite amount of numbers between like zero and one right sure, like, whatever number sure. you choose I could always choose a higher number. Mm-hmm, sure, sure. Like, we play that game forever. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But that can you choose a higher number than seven. It'd be tough, but I think I could maybe pick eight. Okay, 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 okay. I forgot about eight. I forgot about eight. I forgot about eight. But what about like mistake. a lot of people do? What about nine? That's that's really tough because like I don't even know does nine even exist anymore. I heard seven, eight, nine. <laughs> That's true. My two numbers ate each other. Oh my god! What? what? So but they actually didn't. They didn't even. They didn't even eat each other. It was one sided. Why did I say that they ate each other? It was one sided. Just one ate the other. I don't, I don't know why I would say that they're both involved somehow. One just straight assaulted the other, and I. So would that, would I said that it was then both their fault. Seven bigger than nine because seven eight nine, right? So like yeah. if seven eats nine, then it's seven nine plus nine. nine. Seven. Well, no, 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 because it's like it's like it's like if I eat a cheeseburger, right? I'm no longer guy. I'm guy plus cheeseburger, right? At least for a certain amount of time. At least for a certain amount of time. Yeah, yeah. It's it's finite, but I'm but I'm super powered for a minute. I'm 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 guy plus cheeseburger. I'm guy burger, cheese guy, uh, burger but man. But the point is, we'd still call you guy, right? So even though you become one but but would you be burger, accurate? Would you be accurate in calling me guy though what i what i what a scientist who's aiming for accuracy still call me guy Mm -hmm. see i think these are the questions only god himself can answer (laughs) is guy plus cheeseburger greater than guy (laughs) yeah or are you even like same bean anymore true 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 like, so is seven the same being anymore? That's that's where this is all leading to, right? It's all right about is yeah. is seven like, the same being? We're having a crisis at this point. Mm-hmm. So okay, okay. So if you have you have the number seven, and you stuff the number nine in it, right inside yeah. of it, does that mean that seven is now a ravioli? Right. 
Is a nine ravioli? Maybe that maybe that's the way to think about it. Not as seven yeah. as an independent being, but as a brand new substance, a new ravioli, a nine stuffed ravioli. Well, it really depends, right? Because mm -hmm. like, or is like seven more like wrapped around like a hot dog, like a seven a hot dog. Mm, I don't know, but but a, a hot dog's not fully encompassed, right? I said I specifically chose ravioli because when I eat a cheeseburger, I then become a cheeseburger ravioli. Kind of but there's a moment on. there's a moment when you're eating the cheeseburger mm -hmm. right mm -hmm. so th i mean i guess if we're going with the past tense this isn't relevant but assuming right we can use any type of tense of e right okay so while you're eating it like when you're taking a bite of it right uh -huh. before you've actually like bit the part off mm -hmm. you are now a hot dog does a hot dog only come out of one end though or are you oh oh are you saying for that for that moment where where yeah. where my my mouth is the bun, yeah, and yep. and we got the cheeseburger is sitting in my mouth before I've okay okay I I I, I, it off. I, yeah. I see what's going on here I see what's going on here I'm feeling it so so at one point at I, one point I smell what you're stepping in seven seven was a hot dog <laughs> it might be a ravioli now though yeah it might have ascended from from hot dog to ravioli as all things do as is the natural order of life. So I feel like there's a there's a proof here that then all all hot dogs mm -hmm. because not not all hot dogs all ravioli come from hot dogs. Oh, not Ooh. all hot dogs are ravioli because sometimes hot dogs can just stay as hot dogs. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But I like that. But they but they eventually at some point become okay. Yeah, but the only way to become a ravioli is by starting as a hot dog. <laughs> Because of the stuffing process, because so mm -hmm. because yeah. of how you encapsulate whatever your filling is, whether so like, it's turkey, whether it's a nine or whether for it's Thanksgiving, right? Mm -hmm. Turkey. So first of all, turkey starts as a bird, then it turns into a hot dog as you're doing the stuffing process. Okay, as a, as I'm as I'm knuckle deep in this turkey, putting yeah. putting bread in it. Uh huh. And then it finishes as ravioli. I don't know, but it's not fully closed, right? It's not fully closed. Is there is there a is there a type of ravioli or uh, bread product that is uh, not fully closed? That's got a uh, an opening, if you will. So, like a sandwich has an opening all the way around. So that's not that's not yeah, quite analogous. That's not a sandwich. That's not quite analogous. Oh boy, is our boy gonna make this? Is our boy? Oh, he's got full HP. Yeah, he's got a he's got a health pack too. He's cheating. He's a hundred percent cheating. Okay, you can go way faster than this, my dude. Yeah, this guy, this guy's not, this guy's not gunning it. This guy's, well this guy's actually the first time he went outside after COVID lockdown, he visibly jumped at his shadow. Like he's like, <laughs> oh my god, what is that? He's like, oh, oh, that's me. And then he jumped again because once he realized it was him. Because he's actually afraid of his own shadow that much. Like this guy's terrified. This guy, this guy has never made it. To, I don't even. I don't even know. This guy's. He might actually be the groundhog that Puxi I've had every year of my life. Puxatani Phil. Is that what the name of the groundhog is? Oh, you're goddamn right. That's the name of the groundhog. Because I don't think that I don't think that mofo's ever not seen his shadow. <laughs> like, I have, like one year, one year where like. And it's one thing, okay, so he sees his shadow, right? That's one uh -huh. thing, right? Uh-huh, uh-huh. The fact that he's afraid of it and goes back. Oh, the fact, the fact that, that he, the fact that he pulls the squirrel killer? Yeah. Like, okay, you know, year one makes sense. Year mm -hmm. five, still kind of see it. Year ten, a uh, little, little questionable. <laughs> year 20 plus? Like, dude, <laughs> what's going on here? I think, I think you're right. I think squirrel killer is very much Pakistani Phil. Where you're like, so you've seen your shadow before, right? Yep, you understand what a shadow is. Yep. Every time you go outside, you're still terrified and run back inside when you see your shadow. Yep. Yep. It's like, oh, okay. Oh, and when you're when you're when you're inside your home, you don't turn on any lights because you're afraid it'll generate shadows. Yep. And it's like, oh, what do you do at night? And it's like night goggles or night vision goggles. And it's like, oh yeah, of course, of course. Uh huh. Yeah. Of course. I, yeah. yeah. It's intuitive. <laughs> it's intuitive. Yeah. I don't, <laughs> I don't know how you would not use night vision goggles. Yeah. 
What an odd question to ask. <laughs> what, what else? What else would you use to see in the dark besides night vision goggles? I mean, come on. It says it right in the name. Like, we should, we should, uh, we should switch. To see if the other people are this. Let's see, uh, this, this, this terrified. All right, all right, all right. Let's mix it up. Yeah. Squirrel, squirrel killer, you're getting vetoed. You're getting vetoed. What do you? What, is there any? Oh, octo pimp. That jumps out of me. <laughs> yeah, yeah, octo pimp. Like, let's see, let's see what life in the pimp is. Octo pimp in with that follow. Ooh, some crime video. Ooh, 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 ooh. We got. Oh, that's um, that's oh Tom Clancy. Okay, Tom Clancy's only uh, been dead for thirty five years. You know, we can still. We can still make Tom Clancy movies and call him Tom Clancy. It sounds good. I didn't even that one. Oh, this is a this is the dude in Black Panther. Uh, no, it's not. <laughs> yeah, it is. no, it's not. No, no, no. That guy died. That guy died. That guy died. No, not not the not the main guy. Not the main guy. I thought he was. The, oh, uh, oh, oh, oh. Uh... Oh yeah, the guy with the ridiculous name. The guy with the ridiculous name. That's something like it's something like Mister Evil, but it's like way ridiculous like that, right? Yeah, that yeah 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 uh he's also yeah, he's like uh the... rocky the new rocky movies right he's also the main fighter in the rocky movies bah, 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 bah. you know is he yeah well the pro- i mean i shouldn't even be surprised i'm, gonna, I'm somewhat surprised in the idea of remaking rocky but mm-hmm. it's that time of the decade right where mm-hmm. if we're not remaking it are we even trying i'm pretty sure there's two of them maybe three of them so it's like not like a not like a new idea there we got we got Rocky. Okay, okay. So this man, this man's see as you see this active reload that's going on here though. He's actually hitting him. He's actually hitting him. Oh, oh he missed that one. Okay, I shouldn't I shouldn't have said that. Oh, he has to active reload every shot. You see this? Killmonger. Killmonger, see? His name's just like something silly and evil, yeah. Being really subtle with who's the bad guy in this story. You want you want hero McCure hero face or you want Killmonger? Hmm? Which team are you going for, Sam? <laughs> I'd definitely go for Killmonger. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I mean, that's where the cool kids are, right? Dude, I mean, dude, dude made plenty of sense. Dude, dude, what is this thing on the guy's bottom right? Uh, that's Killmonger. What do you mean? Yeah, it looking a little different than I remember him. <laughs> I, well, I, don't know. I mean, Michael B. Jordan put on some makeup and stuff, right? Yo, I mean, he does. General Cream with the follow. Wait, where did uh, where'd you see that at? Because I followed. Oh, oh, that's right, the center. <laughs> it's a mystery. <laughs> where, where is it at, Scooby Doo? I don't know. <laughs> maybe the, maybe the giant red letters in the very center, uh, middle, bottom thing of the screen. Like Jesus. Yeah, Jesus. Yeah, your, your eye spy skills are as good as Stevie Wonder's. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, those those Waldo books, man. Oh man, I never found him. <laughs> never found no. him. Oh, I've been working for years oh. to try and find Waldo. Also, uh, where in the world is Carmen San Diego? No idea. No idea. Literally, don't no idea. know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't you think she actually to, exists. I also have to be able to read a map. Mm-hmm. That that's not a skill that we have. Dude, oh, is, oh, this is wild. wild. This is wild. It's coming down. I thought we we're actually things coming at him too. <laughs> Oh goodness gracious! Hmm. Uh, May, May Malay well, got jealous of me uh, being the most recent thing on there with the follow. He got jealous. Oh, I understand. Yeah, yeah. I understand. Trying to get you completely off the, the grid. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. What happens if you unfollow and refollow? <laughs> We'd kick off Jund Panorama. That's a good name. I'm into that name. This guy's like all about that sword game. Play. Yeah, 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 yeah. Is there like level ups for your weapons? Uh, uh huh. Sure. Probably. Yeah, I'm gonna go. With, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go with. I'm gonna go with a hundred percent. There is based on absolutely nothing. Right. Yeah, yeah. We we seen enough to be experts in this. No. Yeah, 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 yeah. Look at this. Look at this nasty looking thing in the center. I mean, I shouldn't. Ooh. I shouldn't say that about your mother, but you know, like, holy god. Ooh. Holy God! Look at this. look at this. Just... The head thing. Like Gorgon, if you will. Gorgon. He's got some of that like Gorgonzola. He's a ravioli, and you need we need a little cheese to go with the ravioli, and we got some Gorgonzola. There we so go. So that means Gorgonzola at one point was a hot dog. 
<laughs> well, gargantola is a cheese. So. <laughs> <laughs> well, you, I don't know. I don't know what's going on. You're, you're the one that said ravioli with cheese on it. Yeah. All I know is I think gorgonzola's cheese. I don't know. I'm not a cheese expert. You know? Yeah, we don't. We don't live in Wisconsin. Yeah, yeah. I'm not. I'm not some kind of cheese freak, cheese fanatic, right? We let's, we should come up with a name for uh, people that are cheese fanatics. What would you What would you call someone that's a cheese I think fanatic? They call them cheese heads. Oh, I was gonna go with like Steve or like. Peter or something, but you know, Cheesehead is fine too. Cheesehead isn't bad. Look at this. This guy found a pineapple on a f another planet. A murmuring cocoon increased the positive During effects the of SpongeBob something. universe of a pineapple. Yeah, it lives, it lives in the pineapple under the sea. Is that the only place oh, that pineapples God, exist? Where... Under the sea? I mean, I've never seen one not under the sea. Yeah, I mean, I mean, one hundred percent of all pineapples I've ever seen, I guess, uh, I guess, live under the sea. Who knows, man. Who knows? But like, even even if you've seen one, right, mm -hmm. that uh is like not under the sea, mm -hmm. can you disprove that it was never been under the sea? That's a really good point. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It's kind of like kind of like a fish, right? If you see a fish, and yeah. like uh, you go you go to the grocery store and you see a fish, mm -hmm. you're like, mm -hmm. oh. I can draw a reasonable conclusion that that was underneath the water at some point in its life. Yeah. The exact same thing with a pineapple. You can draw a reasonable conclusion that a pineapple was under the sea at some point in his life. When you see an octopimp at the market, you can draw a reasonable conclusion that he was underneath the sea with his octo bitches at some point, you know? Mm. I mean, if you came up with any other uh, conclusion otherwise... Mm -hmm you failed the basic logic test yes absolutely absolutely uh i i maybe shouldn't have said his octo bitches they're they're wonderful women i'm sure in his octo harem you know he's got only the only the finest what is it? there's some like wildness going on also the setting of this is way different right away from like oh my god it's a medusa again yeah yeah, yeah. it's gorgonzola himself well he's gonna die he's gonna die what is this electricity Dude. Like capture him? How's he not dead? I don't know. Is he not doing damage? Like, I mean, look at his health. Look at his health. His health's so low. I feel like these guys are playing on like too easy of a difficulty. Oh, oh, we know. got, oh, we got hit again. And didn't die? Yeah, that's what I mean, right? Like, real difficulty setting it should be if you get hit twice, you're you're for sure dead no matter what. If you get hit once on certain enemies, you're dead. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like big, like big Gorgon man there. Definitely should have been a one shot, right? Otherwise, you're not gonna learn to respect the Gorgon mm -hmm. if he doesn't one shot you. Like and their health is, their health does too much for him. Like oh. he could be it. Okay, is he gonna live off this? Oh, he just healed off it. He healed a little bit. I don't know. Oh! I didn't even, right. I didn't really see what right. hit him. That's it. He's dead. If you made it this far into the video, then you clearly like what you saw. So you should tell YouTube, tell your friends, tell the whole world. And if you watch multiple videos, then you should subscribe so you can see an assortment of videos going on in the future. And if you really want to meme it up with the crew, you should jump in the Discord linked in the description. And the most important part, guys, say a good afternoon, good evening, or good night.